Bonjour. This, <clears throat> if I can stop myself from burping, is the Turing test. Ah, okay, that was it. I'm assuming that's Alan Turing, is it? The guy who invented the internet? New game. New game. Okay, so I know nothing about this. I'm assuming there's going to be a test. All about Turing. <coughs> Yeah. While we wait for it to load. So anyway, how are you? How are you? You don't exist. I am literally recording these as a way of preventing myself from going mad. Every time a new console comes out, oops. Morning, Eva. Your wake up has been sanctioned by the ISA. We lost contact with the ground crew 450 hours ago. We have tried to establish further communications, but we are not getting any responses. We need you to investigate. Okay, doesn't it make sense to do visual checks first? We have already looked at the data. The ISA has made the executive decision that you report to the surface post haste. You are our emergency response. What exactly is the emergency? The ground crew found an organism the ISA believed to be dangerous. <coughs> we need to re-establish communication. Okay, as is with my first plays of these games, uh, I sometimes forget about putting the subtitles on and changing the, the y-axis so you push up and you look down, etc. So this is, what is this? Portal in space? Pardon me. Ooh. A cup. All right, so A is jump. So far, only jump. Why would you need fans if you're wearing a suit? Hmm. Okay. Chris McLean! Cryogenic Awakening! Christmas Eve. So, 480 hours, is, it, is that what they said? 480 hours, that's about eight, 18 days. Oh look, go here, go here. Really? F 
404 not found. So I wonder if that is some sort of secret code. Okay. No doubt somebody's typed that in to a sort of text to hex website. I might look for that later. Is this just to show off game mechanics? Is there any reason why I have to pick these cups up? No reflection in the window. Europa. Oh, jolly good. Energy manipulation tool. Portal gun, in other words. Okay. Have I just been in here? Ooh, hang on. Is this a cup I haven't looked at? Wow. Torch. Take the torch. You literally just pick things up and look at them. But you can't actually use them. Okay. Oh, is this where I go? So this is like a cross between the game portal, perhaps, and the film. What's the ship's status? I have performed the necessary checks. The Europa lander is ready to launch. And the film Moon. If you've not seen it, check it out. Sam Sam Rockwell and. Kevin, inappropriate touching Spacey. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. I think that's everything wound up, Tom. Yes. Well, I guess I'm ready to go down for the long sleep then. Good night, Ava. I will miss your assistance. The ship will be very quiet without you here. Night. See you when I wake up, Tom. You can't change to any other logs, but let's know that the robot is called Tom. Hmm. Fucking J.J. Abrams. Lens flare. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 Star Trek. Bay 3. Thank you, Tom.
if you're going to create a game well, that looks weird with lots of rooms you can't go in and then just simply say you can't go into them because there's a red light compared to people are going to go in and then they're going to go oh that was a bit pointless there's nothing to do in those rooms but what it does is it creates even longer gameplay than is actually needed so if somebody blocked the doors off and only allowed you to go into the doors they wanted you to go in you'd have done the game in about 10 minutes probably this way they can say well oh, i was playing the game for hours i was going around everywhere just in case even though it's got a red light there might be something in there Retro? Go. Fido? Go. Guidance? Go. Control? Go. Telcom? Go. Then we are go for launch initiating. Second. Go. 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 Engaging retro fire. Boo boo boo! I'm running the program. 80 degree delta pitch to 88 degrees absolute. Breaking procedure. Trajectory looks good. 502 alarm. It looks like we're coming in too fast. We are slightly short of the landing site. We are going to have to burn later. I'm there. Go. Full retrograde. to Europa. Thank you very much. Thank you for finally giving me control. As, and this this corridor is literally not chock a block full of fucking snow. Okay. How long will my suit survive these conditions? How shit was that? Okay. <clears throat> Give me something to read during the loading screens. Give me a loading screen with something to read and press X once it's loaded so that I get a chance to read it and then I choose to move on. Otherwise, I'm just staring at a fucking picture. I could have had the dialogue of how long she's going to last in these conditions. Fucking hell. So, do I go back now and find out how long I'm going to last in these conditions? Fuck's sake. Right, 
Alright, so we'll start through then. The base has changed. What do you mean? The base was originally constructed as modules to withstand the seismic activity in and around Thera Magula. It appears the ground team have manipulated these modules. So you've got a camera that follows you. You have a gun and some sort of cube. Okay, so I was expect the base was built initially by machines. I served as the mind of these operations. I arrived first on Europa in 2240. It costs a lot to send humans into space with the necessary life support, especially such a vast distance from Earth. So, robotics built this place. I was half expecting to use this gun a la portal a la half-life 2 ah okay I got it now. I wonder why the ground team has changed these rooms. I have a hypothesis. These rooms are Turing tests. Turing tests? Turing tests are tests designed to tell humans and machines apart. Typically, problems only solvable by a human. A combination of logical and lateral thinking. So, you can't complete these tests, Tom? No. That is why I am glad you are here to help. We need to work together. Right. Plinkety plinky plink plonk. completely repurposed these rooms. I am quite impressed. So, what were they used for before? Most of them were used for storage. But they have converted them beyond recognition. Perhaps they ran out of things to do out here. The devil makes work for idle hands. <coughs> right, so hold and pull down. Yep, that made me feel like I was immersed in uh, realism. Turing tests. Okay. All right. Got you. Okay. Doodle -doo -doo -doo. Uh, do you know the ground team's location? The crew are deeper inside the base, it seems. <sighs> they must be trying to survive. Can you find their precise location? I'm afraid not. I am working to regain control. Though I once had complete control of this base, a lot has changed in the past 500 hours. So now it's 500 hours. Um, okay, so you can't go back. So if I get that. that up there oh, 
piss. Okay. So I can't take the, I can only take the full thing. Right. Bollocks. What am I not seeing here? Can't take the empty one out. Cool air, one thousand. Okay. Thank you. So if this base is managed by you, why can't you find the crew? The base's communication array is malfunctioning. Yeah, I'd start being really suspicious as fuck now of this robot. If it came up with answers like that. Perhaps we can't solve this yet. Perhaps you shouldn't be here yet, because it's another time wasting little bit of the game. What's all this about?
All right, so that's magnetic. Okay, let's go and get, I'm assuming that there's three triangles. So that means you can hold three of the power balls, power cells at one time, I guess. Correct. And now I can't get out. Bollocks. Ah, so I'm supposed to take the Right, I fucking love this already. Okay, so let's. Was that the one? Yeah. Okay, nothing down there. Let's. Take this. So I can't, I can't go through there with a the box. But I can put one in, so there must be... Can't go out that way. Put that one there and take that one. Nope. Fuck. Right, so that's semi transparent. Right, so what happens if you try to take a box? Oh shit, I'm going to sneeze again. Fuck. Gone. Um, what happens if you try to take a box out? Nothing? Okay. It must just check for when you take a box in. Jitters. Right, that's semi transparent.
Alright, so I gotta pick it up again. if there's a timer to this no Right, this has genuinely got me fucking stumped now. There is no point in carrying on making this video. It'll just be me trying to solve this for about two hours now, and that's not going to be much fun. So I'm going to leave this. If this is this difficult for me, at least anyway, uh, this earlier on, I, I'm going to fucking love this because I fucking love this kind of puzzle solving thing. Um, yeah, okay, it's a little bit moon and a little bit portal ish but I, that that no, is not necessarily a bad thing but yeah okay a few glitchy bits you know i wanted to hear the dialogue but then it loaded up the loading screen little shit little, little, little bits like that that's that's game polish that wasn't really done properly uh, it doesn't seem as if it was tested properly or if it was it wasn't actually fixed but I'm just hoping nothing like that happens later on in the game to the point of frustration or I lose out hearing an important piece of information. Um, that being said, uh, I like this. I like this a lot and I heartily recommend you check it out if you haven't already. Um, if you have already and you want to somehow let me know what the fuck I'm doing wrong, that would be great. But for now, the video is going to end while I suss out how to get out of this Goddamn room. Yes. Goodbye.